Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Streets of Rogue. What are we going to do this time? I think first things first, we have a decent amount of nugs to spend. So let's go ahead and spend those 66 nugs on, I don't know, just a bunch of traits. Just get as many as we can. They're getting really expensive now, which is a little bit of a problem. But you know what? We're going to make it work. So where are we going? What are we going to do? Um, a jock? Master of Disaster. Uh, we receive experience for objects and walls that are destroyed. We can't use computers. Items cost more in the shop. And we always make noise. But we can charge. And we can't stop. Okay, that's going to be interesting. This is going to be a really <laughs> weird... Uh, this is going to be a weird run. I'm ready. I'm ready. I think... Whoops! I did not mean to do that. What I meant to do was come into audio. Turn this up just a little bit. Because I've changed my uh, volume properties just slightly. Hey, it's me. Okay, what do I have to do? I have to destroy 11 beds. Destroy every type of a certain object. Okay. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay, we refreshed our bat. Oh my, oh my god. Ah! Dude, what? How did I miss that? Sorry! It wasn't me! Um, well we have a gun now. That's good. So we need to take you to the exit. We've pissed off a random slum dweller. Dude, there's so many... There's so many beds in this hospital. Why is a doctor sleeping in the hospital? What? That thief just got away with murder. And we got a four-leaf clover. That's pretty, uh, pretty useful. It's a really useful thing to have early on. At least I think so. Okay. Since we don't care about stopping, we'll just... I hope that wasn't the Celematic. Dude, they are all so mad. Oh, that's a shapeshifter. Pissing off everybody. It's alright. I've got 140 health. I have... There are no cops here. How am I supposed to do this, this big quest, uh, on floors with cops? Got him! Holy crap. So this is going to be a high, hectic run, okay? But, let's made this a little easier. Get a lockpick. Hey man, don't worry about it. I just got to destroy these beds. You're just kind of in the way. I'm sorry, but it just it had to be done. Our trajectory is fine. And we got our big quest done. I'm going to need a lot of, like, melee-centric abilities. Because this is going to be nuts. I'm going to have to fight so many dudes at so many points in my life. Everybody's so angry. Wait, what happened down here? Well, we got our big quest done. I want to find that shapeshifter, and I want to take him out. I'm also going to have to be careful in the future. Uh, oh, there's the shapeshifter. Oh, God. He's running. Oh, there's a treasure chest there? Um, that wasn't, that didn't go as planned. Where'd the shapeshifter go? Oh, man. Now he's gone. That was a, that was a big risk, I have to admit. He's not just gonna go back to where I popped him out. He's gonna go take over another body. If I was him, that's what I would do. God, the confusion. Go away. Okay, okay. 
We good. Where's the shapeshifter? There he is. Come here, you little naked rat. Nice. And we're done here. Let's go. Good job. We didn't take that much damage, all things considered. In fact, I thought I had... Oh, I did have less health than this, then I leveled up, and then I took more damage. Okay, so that's worse than I thought it would be. Teleport anytime, regardless of location, unless you are in immediate danger. Um, no infighting. Let's go ahead and go with no infighting. Because I think if I can end up with some way to have uh, a lot of friends, I need to destroy all the chairs. There's very few chairs. Most of them are in this room. I will not, sir. Ah! Please don't shoot. Don't shoot me, please. I, my delicate frame can't handle it. Oh my god. All right, unfortunately, you slum dweller, I'm gonna have to take that chair from you. But I get a quest done, I get a mini fridge, which is gonna be incredible. Sorry, man. It's just no hard feelings or anything, but dude. No hard feelings, it's just what has to be done. Oh! I've been crushed. This is bad. Got him. Okay. Oh. Whew, whew. I don't know why I wanted to go and attack you. I don't know what my initial feeling was on that, but that was not... That was not going to be a good plan. We have to neutralize that guy. Oh boy, I don't want to neutralize that dude. <coughs> I'm gonna have to. Is there anything that I can sell right now? Sell some cigs. Uh, can I hold? Should I hold on? I think I'll hold on to the lockpick for now. It's not like we're. It's not like we're hurting for inventory space or anything. Where's the rest of my chairs, by the way? Does it tell me if I find them? That's a good question. I don't know. It does. And they happen to believe, uh, to believe, to be in the police station. That was weird. The, the chair just exploded. It wasn't me. Don't watch me. Leave now? Okay. Yeah, no problem. I got this. I'm where I need to be. Oh, I have to destroy that. Oof. So one of the big risks about playing the jock is if you're charging through stuff, you might just run into a generator. And that generator can generate a really bad time for you. But the real question is, how does one destroy a generator in a very small building such as that when you have 20 health? And how do you do it without dying? Do I have to go back to the... I have to destroy... I have to kill the cops? I don't want to kill the cops. Ah, man. I have some money. I need you to attack that generator. Okay, that works. And we got an earwarp whistle. That's right, we can't do anything silently. So that's normal, that's normal, that's normal. Okay, you, I want you to go in and... I don't know, go attack that guy. I think... I think if we get that guy gone... I have a wrench. 
They don't want me to be in here. Honestly, I can't say that I blame them. Oh. He's hostile to me. Annoyed. Now he's hostile. Okay, I need to... I need to... I need to break this guy up. Maybe he'll help me. He's not gonna help me. Alright. Here's the question. Here's the answer. I want to give you a little bit of a prize. You can have the wrench. And with the wrench, what I want you to do... Where's the thief going, man? With the wrench... I can't get you to go in there? the door locked? It is locked. So we have a key. Now you can get in there. Looks like that might be a crusher. No, it's a it's a weak thing. Wait, you have a knife? I thought I gave you a wrench. I, I did give him a wrench. We leveled up! Oh boy. Okay. 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 Having to be real careful. I'm frightened. Of the things that are possible. Okay. Yes, please neutralize for me. How did you miss that? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Is my guy winning? He's winning. He's won. It's the perfect crime. Okay, uh, it's gonna be up there somewhere. You just gotta go in. Imagine having to play the entire game this way. All right, go for it. Dude, you did it. And I got another police baton for it. All right, everything is coming up Millhouse. Um, can I get you to give that back to me, by the way? What if I get you to attack the drug dealer? So I want him to die. Okay, that works. I got whiskey and his wrench. Or I got my wrench back and I got his whiskey. Fantastic. Let's go. Maybe I should be breaking more stuff too. How did I increase my electability? Player doesn't fall down when charging into walls. Oh my gosh. That seems really important. I'm not gonna lie, that seems incredibly important. We need to destroy three beds. Periodic radiation, get inside. Dude, gun's not fair. Gun's not fair, dude. Oh my god. Get all that crap out of here. That was, that was 10 different ways of not fair. I have taken so much health. I need like armor or something. Now I need to get all the way to the other side. I suppose I can open that preemptively. Remember, we have to keep our eye open for beds. Destroy and retrieve. Are there any beds in there? It doesn't seem so. Get out of here. Goodbye, thief. Looks like you're gonna have a rough, rough day, buddy. 
That didn't feel very good. Whew. Okay, there should be a bed in here, right? There's no bed. I, there's no bed, and I didn't destroy it either. What the heck? Oh, there is a bed. Literally just look two feet to the left. There's nothing in there. Maybe I should be destroying more things. It's like two experience each. Yeah, it's like two experience each. It's like hardly even worth my time. Burn. Yes. Uh, let's go ahead and get in here. He's got a gun. That's not what I need. He's got a shotgun. Rude? Alright, we gotta get out of here. Um, should be one more bed somewhere. It's way up there. Okay. I'm surprised it told us straight up where that is. Let's go ahead and sell these empty guns. Who needs them? Still gonna hold on to the lockpicks temporarily. Wasn't me. Wait, how do you know? Oh, yes! <laughs> And a first aid kit. Hell yeah, dude. Okay, this is... This isn't good. But I have an idea. I have a way to get in and out. Actually, it's steel. So... Okay, I have another idea. Since this is steel, we have to go this way. Big quest is done. No harm, no foul. And I think, honestly, we kind of want to come in here. I think we want whatever this guy has. Thank you. $26. Sure, I'll take it. Level up, please. Thank you. Dude, is that the thief? That's the thief. Okay, <clears throat> I don't think we're gonna level up on the next floor, but you know what? We're doing good. Uncrits. Oh. Damage inflicted on the player may not cause any health loss. Let's be as tanky as possible. I think that's the only way we're gonna be able to get through this. Thank you. Is he coming? He is. Good night, friend. Uh, this was the easiest quest that's ever existed. I, I really should be breaking doors down instead of uh, opening them. I should be breaking everything in front of me. It doesn't, it doesn't take away my durability for my weapons. So it's literally, there's no reason not to. Other than, I guess, saving a few seconds. Actually, what do I have to destroy? Exploding barrels? Oh, shucks. Okay. Uh, destroying exploding barrels, it's not so bad. There's only four of them. Hey, knock, knock, man. This is bad, actually. A doctor and a drug dealer living together in harmony. That is, until the Jock Nation attacked. Only the Avatar is able to something or something. You know the story. I don't need to give you the play-by-play -play of that. Can I charge through that? I can. 
Hee <laughs> hee, thank you. Doors mean nothing to me. Is there a computer here? Yes. Ah! Help? I can't... I can't open that door without killing the scientist. Okay, that cop's on their side. This is bad. Dude, I'm caught between two bullshits. Dude, stop! That was all sorts of bad. Um... Okay, we got a wrench. Please. I want your bat. Okay, countdown started. I don't give no stinking hoot about no stinking countdown. All I care is about care about is like killing everybody on this Ow! I forgot the that that was an explodey one. Got him? Do I have this? I do. Okay. Okay. Look, I just want inside your fridge. I should have noticed that he was there. Um, that was my bad. That one was completely my bad. I still have to destroy a couple of exploding barrels. Uh, none up there. Careful of the trolley. Because the trolley is a problem. Oh, they're here in the center. Wow! I did not know it could do that! Amazing. Okay, there's a clone machine there. Um... Augmentation station. Let's, uh, let's see what this... Can we upgrade anything? Uncrits? We don't have enough money to upgrade anything, but leveling that up? That's gonna be the best thing ever. Sucker, computer illiterate. Loud. I don't quite want to remove any of these yet. <coughs> I can swap them though. Species? Gorillas attack on sight. Extra experience for killing gorillas. Okay, that's not the worst thing in the world, but it's also not very good either. Oh, man. Honestly, I don't know if we're going to be able to uh, get enough experience to level up here. Here, get a wide arc item for this. Break as many things as humanly possible. You need the experience. Don't go into the cop station and do that, though. Just blowing up toilets. It's really not worth that much. Okay. Please level me up. Yeah, okay. Cool. No, wait. No, we're so close. Just had to destroy a few more things. It's fine. We got this. We got this. Destroy the door. Destroy the toilet. There we go. Where's the, why does the fireman care about anything here? Actually, can I destroy an ATM and get money out of it? No, that's it's too easy. I need to destroy fire hydrants. Okay. Got it. <laughs> You better stop that. It's just a little bit of light vandalism, officer. I promise, the owner is okay with it. Um... Okay. I apologize. There's a cop nearby.
Goodbye. I just wanted this. Oh, Jesus. That, see, that was your fault. You did that. It wasn't me. My baseball bat's gone. See, now I need to throw a rock. Oh, I thought that was me. Oh my god. <laughs> that was horrifying. Okay, I'm gonna have to break in the old-fashioned way. I guess I wouldn't call that old-fashioned per se, but, you know, it's cool. Oh god. What have I done? Oh, he's poisoned. Brilliant. Now, if I could get the trait that says that explosions that I cause don't uh, do damage to me, I think that would be a really, really good situation for us. And my reasoning is... I have to say my reasoning's pretty obvious. I don't need to tell you. I want your knife. I want all of your melee weapons. I want all of the melee weapons. I can't... I can't get in here. I have no way to open it. Fine, break your TV. Watch yourself. Oh god. Ooh, so much damage being taken. I'm at 45 health. Oh, a sword! I've already taken that fridge. I'm gonna have no use for a gorilla translator at this point either. Which I think is one of the more interesting... Uh... Situations. Here, you, um... You take care of that guy. Um, that didn't work out for me. Uh, I need another blood, please? Oh, Jesus. Uh, not that one. Not that one. Dude, the slum dweller took that money. I need that, man. Oh. Alright, these guys will work, I guess. Um, hey, bros. How about you come here? How about you and I? We go, ooh, we go cause some good old fashioned havoc. Uh, go and take that guy out. Please, thank you. Ooh, got him. Yeah, and they're none the wiser. I'll just clean everything up. Uh, thanks for letting me clean everything up for you. Why do you have to have a gun? Why do you have to have a shotgun specifically? Okay. Inventory is full. My inventory is full. Hey fellas, it's me. See, I'm throwing away so much money by hiring these guys as protection, but I should be causing a little more chaos. And I think there are probably ways that I could be doing this that are a little... probably more proactive. Got him, got him. Got him. Okay. Another pistol. Bye! Oh, that cop is super dead. Very- Whoa! Whoa! How did they know? Oh! How- 
How did they know it was me, though? Oh, I should have hid better. You know what? That's a good way to. That's a good place to stop. Uh, hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you enjoyed this burning trash fire that this run was. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.